Question, what would you do if your girlfriend pulled a shady move that might make you think she is sleeping with your best friend? Let's get into the story. So yesterday, I'm making dinner in my apartment with a lot on my mind. I planned on having a talk with my girlfriend after dinner about her behavior with my roommate and best friend. I had been suspicious for some time about something going on between the two of them. Then out of nowhere, with my roommate in the kitchen with me, my girlfriend comes out of the bedroom and just her towel. I thought to myself, can she see my roommate is sitting at the counter on his computer? It was like something out of a movie as she poured a glass of wine leaning against the counter as if she's not just in a towel. I'm watching as she leans more and more forward with her breasts getting pressed together until you can almost see her areolas coming out of the towel. By the way, my girlfriend is just inches away from my roommate. His eyes were locked on her like he didn't care if she were my girl and I was standing right there. Finally, she just stood up and walked back into the bedroom. For real, y'all, is this innocent or malicious? All right, fam. So that was a really interesting letter, to say the least. Um, It felt so interesting. I would say, brother, you might want to lay off of reading like the the romance novels or or you know watching like some of the movies online like 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 you might see on HBO because he wrote it like it was like a a romance novel. She pressed herself up against the counter. But anyway, let, let's jump into the topic. We're gonna break this one down. Um, I, you know what? Let's approach it from three different angles. Okay. So the first one is, bruh. I think your homie and your girl have already hooked up. So the reason I'm approaching it from that angle is it's kind of rare you see a a female coming out the bedroom pretty much butt naked because what you're saying is she just had a towel on, right? The the, the letter says, you know, she's coming out in her towel. I'm surprised he didn't say dripping wet from head to toe. But, But anyway... So she's coming <laughs> coming out of the room naked in a towel and your boy is right there and he's looking at her. She knows he's looking at her. My mind would drift to the point where I think they've already hooked up and you're like the last one in the know because, you know, if she's not ashamed of letting her goodies be all out in the open in front of your dude, then it, it kind of gives that vibe that your dude has probably seen everything that she has to offer. I mean, you know, what are your thoughts? It, that could be. That could be. But if your girlfriend is coming out of the room in a towel, you know, with nothing else on other than the towel in front of your boy then I think she's looking for a little special attention or maybe she's feeling your, maybe she's really feeling your friend and uh, she's trying to get his attention or maybe she's trying to make you jealous. I mean, females do some pretty wild things to get their man's attention. So it it kind of feels like to me that she's being mm, kind of petty in a sense by coming out first off in a towel in front of your friend and in front of you, her boyfriend. So that just sends off signals that um yeah she's she's trying to get some real serious attention around there maybe she's not getting it from you maybe she's trying to get it from your boy so just and and once again just trying to stay in the lane for just a second so do you agree or disagree that she's probably already hooked up with him uh i don't know I, i it's hard to say that just because she came out in the towel you know exposed top part of her boobs doesn't mean that she's hooked up with his friend okay so let, let, let's steer in a different direction so once again heading down three lanes my thoughts is she's potentially already cheated let's 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 just say 
they haven't cheated. Let's talk about the next topic before we try to say she's purely innocent and looking for attention. Let's stay in that lane. Let's just say they haven't hooked up. If they haven't hooked up, bruh, they want to hook up. And that's why she's coming out showing herself to, you know, advertise the goodies a little bit so if they haven't hooked up it could be just the whole you know COVID-19 everybody's at home so they can't you know they can't find the appropriate time so I've seen that in in some scenarios where it gives that that you know that you can tell there's some tension in the room and they're doing things to kind of egg each other on or you know turn yeah. each other on i mean what are your thoughts there you know i don't know I, I i just see i feel like in this letter he probably should have uh maybe revealed or not if he had asked either one of them if they had something going on um but that would that would that would definitely be kind of awkward though you know no, if you if you don't know accusing your mans of hitting your girl all, it, 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 gets, it, it, it gets wacky. You but know it's I mean? a way that you can say it without saying it. There's plenty of ways you can say it and without coming and saying, hey, are you cheating with my girl? Are you sleeping with my girl? There's other ways that he could have said it to just kind of threw it out there or threw it on him and be like, you know, what's up? What's really going on? But he, uh, I really wished in this letter that he would have maybe told us if he had asked his girlfriend, what the hell are you doing? Like, yeah. like why are you coming out here in front of me and my boy dressed like or a hat or not even dressed at all like that like what are you doing you know what i mean i mean what would you guys do if you were in that situation me uh, you would think at some point guy code would kick in and he'd be able to at least you know if, if that's your dude if, if your dude is living with you even if you, you're feeling a little shaky with your girl and what's going on because she's the one coming out you you would think that because you're the homie you'd be able to get it you know get it in with your boy but you know dudes is shady too you know they'll do anything to get a little mm -mm on the side and that 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 may be what's going on but you know uh i guess before we we close this one out let's steer back to what you mentioned earlier Mm -hmm. that third option maybe nothing's going on and this is one that you will only know with is your girl all about the attention now like you've mentioned before maybe she's trying to make him jealous I I have seen a lot of females where it is all about the tease uh, all about am I sexy all about can I get this dude to look at me I'm not saying it's right but there are a lot of females that it's all about see me love me you know so i i get where you were going earlier in the conversation about i mean basically we've got those one of three options either they've already hooked up like we mentioned before uh either they want to hook up or she has no interest in hooking up but she just wants to see you know what your mans would do if she popped out half naked it's it's an awkward um, situation to be in either way but you know what are your final thoughts there uh final thoughts is to confront your girlfriend right i mean even before you wrote this letter you should have confronted your girlfriend off top hey what's up why are you coming out dressed like that why are you looking like that in front of my dude in front of my friend i would never disrespect you in front of your girls and come out here naked or half naked so what's up what's really going on do you guys have something going do you like him? What's going on? Uh, communicate. That would be my final thoughts. Yeah, I mean, I think everything kind of gets worked out in the communication lane. Now, I, I do get that maybe if you're that type of brother that, uh, you know, doesn't like conflict, I could see where you might have some pause. But, bruh, if you think your girl might be hitting your man in your place, yeah. At some at some point, you gotta man up, yeah. you know, put Absolutely. put them on and, and and handle your business, and, and and that's kind of a wrap here on messy and motivational. Where sometimes life gets messy, but we try to get you 
motivated to do the right thing. If you like what we were talking about today, look, we come out with episodes throughout the week, Monday through Friday, talking about topics like this, letters we see online, letters people send to us. And then, of course, we get into things that are just like relationship, you know, related. So feel free to search for us online. We are on Instagram. We're on Reddit. Uh, You can also subscribe to us on YouTube there. Just search hashtag messy motivate and then we should pull up there if you see any of our videos you'll see one of us there just click that red subscribe button which will keep you connected with us there on youtube that also helps us to keep the videos showing up for you when we have these topics and also if you want to get involved what do you what do you think brother man should be doing here should should he be confronting or should he just kind of let it go whatever you can let us know in the comments on that video and that will come straight to us and we also stay in the comments and talk back with you but any final words before we close this one out well uh you got some work to do bruh get on it bruh and that was all with messy and motivation